are ready today I'm here to do this prom look for y'all it's I really don't even know how to describe it it's very simple and sultry and soft looking face and I think it's extremely elegant and would look gorgeous on anybody so if y'all were interested and want to see how to get this look right here then just keep watching so I've already applied my moisturizer my primer and my foundation so the first thing we're going to do is apply a concealer and I'm going to be using the uh, MAC Pro Longwear Concealer because it very much of a full coverage. You could use this as a foundation if you wanted, but um, I'm just going to use it as a concealer under my eyes. And it's a lighter shade, which I want my eyes to be bright. So um, this is a really good concealer. And I'm just going to put one pump right on my hand because it's easier to control that way. And what I'm going to do is take my finger and I'm just going to be applying this under my eye just by like kind of pressing it and you're gonna go like down to your nose and make sure you get right there in the inner like by your tear duct of your eye because that's where most of your like dark circles are. I'm gonna put some on my nose right here so I just kind of press it And then I'm going to have to kind of wipe it, blend it, but I wipe kind of gently so I can make sure I'm getting all that coverage. I'm going to take my Cover Talks 10 powder and it's supposed to like help with wrinkles. It's translucent, but I, I just put it right on my forehead. And then I go in with my MAC uh, Mineralized Skin. Mineralized Skin Finish in Natural. You can use a big fluffy powder brush if you want, but I'm just going to use my e.l.f. powder brush. And you're just, I'm not going to go really all the way under my eyes because I still want that bright, but I'm going to get it so it looks a little bit more natural and down here under my face, but it's going to apply that coverage. And I'm just kind of like stippling it on. I'm not really wiping. This is optional. I'm just going to go in and fill in my eyebrows and I'm going to be using my NYC eyebrow kit in brunette. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to do my eyes. The first thing I'm going to do is prime my eyes so that my eyeshadow will not crease and it will stay on all night and make sure you get that primer underneath your eyes I'm going to be using Zypher out of my Urban Decay uh, book of shadows and you can use any white uh, this does this is a little bit of a shimmer in it you want a white eyeshadow so you're just going to Apply it like this. For the crease, oh, I'm going to be going into my Naked palette and I'm going to be taking two colors. I'm going to be blending Buck and Naked. And this is how I'm going to do it. You're going to go into Buck and you're going to tap it a couple times and go into Naked and tap it and then Buck one more time. And then I'm going to go into my crease and just kind of blend all through there kind of blend over that a liner brush and you're going to take buck and go right underneath your eye your um, bottom lash line go back into my urban decay book of shadows and i'm going to go into midnight cowgirl and it's this gold where is it right here this gold shimmery color, if you can see that, it's so pretty. Looks like this. Ooh. Apply that all over your lid. And then also apply it right there on your inner tear duct and kind of a little bit into the bottom of your lot bottom of your eye. can take any white eyeliner but I'm using my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil and Milk of course and you're going to apply that underneath on your waterline lightly. Now take any liquid eyeliner. I'm going to be using my Urban Decay 24-7 uh, waterproof liquid eyeliner because prom nights are usually long.
The first thing I'm going to do is contour, and I'm going to be using my NARS Casino Bronzer. It's just a very matte, dark bronzer. And then take that contour up into your hairline and drag it up to your temples and your hairline. Oops, so like that. I'm going to curl my eyelashes, CoverGirl Lash Perfection, first, I'm going to take my um, Maybelline one by one. Now, if you are kind of like me and you don't really need fake eyelashes or you just don't want to wear them, you can coat on quite a bit of mascara and get a really pretty look. So, I'm going to take the Falsies Volume Express Black Drama. Let's go over my eyelashes again. I'm going to take my uh, Bad Gal Lash by Benefit. Now, for blush, I am kind of going for a bronzy look and I don't really want any pink necessarily in my my First look I'm is the elf peachy keen and it just looks like this it's very soft like the color is very soft then I'm going to take the elf candid coral for a highlight I'm going to be using my Wen Wild Mega Glow Illuminating Powder, and this is in 345 Catwalk Pink. It's just these multiple colors, and I'm going to blend them with my finger. Sweep it right there on my cheekbone. Make sure you kind of rub it around just to make it a little bit more blended. Right there above your lip. Scandinavia Moisture Lock Finishing Spray because, like I said, you want to keep your makeup on all night. What I'm going to do is I'm going to apply some chapstick and I'm going to be using my baby lips. I'm using Max Lip Lip Pencil and this is in the color Spice. Go ahead and line your lips. I kind of rubbed the end of it on top of my lip and then um, smacked it with the top part of my lip. I'm going to be using a MAC lipstick and this is called Hug Me. It's just this dark. You're going to take that and apply it. Just really like this look a very soft but sultry eye because of that winged eyeliner and the really dramatic lashes and then a very dark lip that just kind of I don't know it's very mysterious looking so I really liked this look I had a lot of fun thinking of something just different I seen a lot of red lips a lot of pink lips and um, you know, I just, I kind of wanted to branch out and do a little something different. If you enjoyed this look, then just leave comments down below. If you use this look for your prom, um, send me a picture on Twitter. I really hope y'all enjoyed this look and this tutorial. I'll see y'all in my next video.